you're worried about breastfeeding, you're not alone. Check out this video to learn how having mother-to-mother -mother support can help you give your child the greatest gift of all. When a mom is brand new, everything is insecurity. Self-doubt is right there. So it would be very difficult without the appropriate support for a first-time mother without a peer counselor or an appropriate support person. They have the nurses and the providers and the lactation consultants while they're in the hospital, but once they're discharged to their home, um, they can feel very scared and alone because they don't have somebody to turn to. And there's so many reasons that a, a mom will want to turn to someone who has any kind of authority. Having someone be there for you is, um, being, is a great thing because, of course, when, when you need someone to call or if something's not working out, if the baby's not latching on, if something's, you know, something's not right. Breastfeeding was just another challenge on top of learning to be with a baby all the time, so I really needed help. I can speak to mother-to-mother -to -mother support both as a physician and as the mother of two. And I had a lot of difficulties breastfeeding um, my first baby. I was discharged from the hospital and feeling very alone because my mother didn't breastfeed and I don't have any sisters. The way our world is set up now, our mothers may be across the world um, or really far from us. We may not have friends that are having babies currently. Um, other relatives um, might not be available for that mom. So having a support group, a support network is really important because it helps um, provide the support that was there historically for the mother. With knowledgeable support, what was once overwhelming becomes easy to do. I'm a first time mother, don't know what to do, I'm very scared at this point because I don't want to stop breastfeeding. Most people, if they didn't have a peer counselor maybe, might have said, you know what, I give up, I just can't do this anymore, it's just not working out, and then they'd run to the store or something and buy some formula. Having that special someone to call is so important. Here are the top reasons why you should seek mother to mother support. And so that's really what the role of the peer counselor is, to provide the support for common issues that may come up with breastfeeding so that the mom's confidence increases and she's able to go ahead and breastfeed her baby. The good thing about the Breastfeeding Peer Counsel Program is we encourage her to do what she wants to do. And then by empowering her with her choice, her decision, giving her that reinforcement, and then she's able to say, I can do this. With support, you're never alone. Take a look at the women who have benefited from mother-to-mother -mother support. My daughter is very healthy and now I'm breastfeeding my son. I was given phone numbers and I was given one-on-one -on -one, um, counseling. It really saved my breastfeeding relationship. They have also helped me give me the confidence that I needed to stay breastfeeding and not switch to formula. It really helped me get through all the challenges of breastfeeding. So you're probably wondering how mother-to-mother -mother support works, right? Here's how. I help moms with breastfeeding, give them information, support, encouragement, sometimes some hands-on if they have some challenges. Basically in the beginning, the, the support that we do give a mother is actually we give them their, their self-confidence. It's like look, teaching a child to walk. You're holding their hands as they take their baby steps until they take those first two steps on their own. Every baby is different and every mother and child relationship is different so you really, they have to be getting that individual one-on-one -on -one attention and support. One of the best parts of the Breastfeeding Peer Council program is being available support and information that a mom may not get on her own whether it's through family, through doctor, through information on the internet. To have personal information from a mom myself, and I've done breastfeeding, and I can give her information that I've learned through, through my training or through my personal experience. The real mother-to-mother -mother support is not something that's necessarily coming from a doctor to a patient or a nurse to a patient. That's something that is you know, coming from a peer to a peer. And we can never really um, mimic that relationship quite as well as, as the peer support group. 
Um, having a peer counselor has helped me um, definitely boost my confidence, knowing that there is someone that has had, you know, has done this before and knows their ins and outs of what needs, what is needed to be done. It was very helpful to have her to call whenever I want to, and she re returns my calls right away. And she calls me frequently, so she's always checking up on me. Before you pick up the bottle, pick up the phone instead and call a local mother-to-mother -mother support program. So whether you are someone who wants group support or you thrive on individual support, there's support out there for you. You just need to know to ask for it. Save you money. Day. 